on just kind of what the show is. Um, but you probably know that I like Toy Story, quite did like Toy Story. Just never really showed it in the channel that much. And I've worked on this probably um, like two years by now, maybe even longer than this channel has been alive. I want to create a realistic mystery with the head. And well, today I literally just got bacon eyes and I just had to bake them in the oven. <sighs> They're baking clay, if you're wondering. So yeah. The body I had made months ago, previously. If I'm going to eyes are separate. I do, it does have pegs for separate feet, shoes, whatever you say. I used to have separate shoes for them, but I have lost all the time and I got to try and find a new pair of separate shoes. I do plan on making other pieces. I did have another um, mouth piece and it was uh, the 234 one. Just never, I was kind of lost that, so yeah. That's all the pieces of them. There's ham, it's the Sega ham, it's the only real ham I have. But here's the body. This isn't that yet bad. Isn't the worst custom? I've seen worse ones that look like a lot well, worse than this. Uh, I've worked this for over a year. That's why the body's all scuffed up. I kind of had to paint him a few times. But it didn't work out, so we had the washroom and now I just kind of got a little stains. I'll try to clean them up here. So yeah. It's quite a nice thing. Oh yeah, if you're wondering how I did the pupils on the eyes, they were just, um, Pasca pen marker. Uh, I'm pretty sure you can, I can do Picasso, if I wanted to. Let's see, how did Picasso go again? Um, let's see. I actually can't, oh, what? Oh, hi. Oh yeah, now he's in the middle. But, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's a good, isn't it? Yeah, I can do that. I will get a new lip. It's a new lip piece once I find it. I don't plan on doing Mrs. Potato Head. There's more fan of Mr. Potato Head. I more like Mr. Potato Head and Ham, Slinky Dog. And a lot of the background characters. I had Rocky, the bunker somewhere. He said Mattel Wall came out quite recently. But basically, that's him. He's quite a nice. We um thing about what we were last time so you can see him before the video ends. Get a nice look at him. He may not be the best one, I'm probably am gonna get new guys sometime soon. I might get the blind squirrel props one off and um, what do you call it? Etsy. Maybe just I probably will get the robots or anything like that. Because they're quite expensive. I d I don't want to spend a lot of money. And they're all spent on this is around Maybe just a 10 or 15 quid. You could probably make this one, something like this, for around 15 quid. Like the clay I got is around 7 pounds. The potato head you can get them just cheap, it's like 5 quid. I actually don't remember how much I got my I got around 7 pounds in the box. But this, but this one I had. But a lot of the pieces are from the Toy Story 2 one back in 1990, I think 1999-2000. Alright, so, there we go. I do have a lot of the other pieces for him. I'm hoping, hoping to get them all on soon. This is kind of the first real prop I've made. Screen accurate thing. I, you probably didn't even know I made something. I like Toy Story, what I do, and now you know. So yeah, I quite like Toy Story. Let's see. I did have bendy arms for him. Uh, I actually had one in the head, but for some reason the pegs just wouldn't stay. They get fallen out, and you talk glue and all, and this wouldn't stay. But there he is, Mr. Potato Head. I haven't got eyebrows yet on him. I might do eyebrows in the future. I might just glue them onto that. There's ham. Sega ham. He goes quite nice beside Sega ham. I don't have a big Rex to compare him to your Slinky Dog, because Slinky Dog is broke. A good few years back now. But that's basically it, Mr. Potato Head. He's got back compartments now. Minus. Yeah, oh. But yeah, that's kept his eye. What was I? Oh. The one eyed first. And then he put back to Fort Yeah. 
the hat of fell on it. But that's basically him, Mr. Retain Head. There's the mask of him at least. Do his eyes. Because they literally have finished out the oven there now. Uh, I'm very happy with them. So it's probably the best one yet. I did have other ones in the past, and they weren't as good as this. So I just want to say thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video.